It's still sealed. Oops. Whoa! What are you doing? I think we found the tomb. I've got to see this myself. Brilliant! Who is that? It's magnificent. Wow. It's the curse. Everyone, get out of here! Oh, if I can just get this light to turn back on. No! That's done. Haven't done that. Check. Did that.
Looks like I need to find out who the four sons of Horus were. The flashlight isn't working. I better find something else to light the way. There's not much fuel. I better save this for lighting things on fire. A lamp! Great! I just need to find a way to get it working. I need to find oil for the lamp. My dictionary could help translate that. Yes? What do you think of this tomb? What are you getting at? It's amazing! The amount of detail, the size... Well, someone really important must be buried here. After 5,000 years of recorded history, that could be said about every hole in the ground. But that's what you think, isn't it? I don't leave the house for anything less than amazing. So, it's safe to assume this is going to be a major find? You tell me. Who do you think is buried here? No, I do not guess. Who are you hoping to find here? Who does everyone want to find? The Lost Queen. Who is that? Nefertari. Why is she lost? Over 100 years ago, they found her tomb, the most magnificent of its kind. But when they opened the tomb, do you know what they found? Uh, nothing? They found two kneecaps. The queen was nowhere to be found. Why is that? Nobody knows. I say she was never there to begin with. Do you have proof? No. The people who had proof have been dead 100 times longer than they were ever alive. So, they're not talking. We have to learn to think like they did. But it's not easy. Anyone who says different, lies. Or is stupid. Is it strange that some of the hieroglyphs don't make sense? There is a saying. If a lion could speak, we would not understand him. So, let's say, one day, magically, poof! A very smart lion learns to speak the king's English. How he understands the world is so radically different that even though you understand the words he spoke, you could never understand what he was trying to say. Is that how you think of the ancient Egyptians? Yes. Now let me show you why I am the best archaeologist in the world, in one simple step. Okay, go ahead. I am Ramses the Second. Okay. I, Ramses the Second, I look at my kingdom. Look at it with me. Be Ramses with me. Come now, survey the kingdom. We are kings. Look at the sands. They part in the most elegant tribute to our majesty. Listen to the river. You are not doing it. Sorry, I'll try harder. Good. Listen to the river. 
That is better. The birds of prey and even the deadly serpents bow before us. They look to us as if we were the sun. And remember, we are Ramses. We are the sun, most favored by Ra, sun god. The heartbeat of this world is for us alone. Looking at all of this, what do you want? What could I possibly want? Exactly. Now tell me, what are you afraid of? I guess losing what I have. Yes, you are thinking like a pharaoh. Now tell me, how could you lose what you have? I can't lose anything. I'm the pharaoh. Wrong. You can and you will. You will die, Ramses II. You will be gone and forgotten. Okay, but how does all of this lead to the Lost Queen? For thousands of years, the lion spoke and no one understood. But understand the fear and you understand the man. I translated the hieroglyphs. Beginner's look. I'd better get going. Bye.